Good morning, YouTubers. It is Saturday, April 13th, 2013. Today is somebody's 13th birthday. Happy 13th birthday, Spring. I don't know if you'll ever see this video, but happy 13th birthday. All right, I noticed on my video that, like I said in previous recordings, one is going to go in the blooper reel. Um, that on my end, it's skipping and dragging. I noticed that this morning. Um, I'd ask people, I would look, I would have looked at all the wonderful comments to see, but I only got two, so I didn't, um, I can't tell whether or not it's other people on other people's ends, but if it's skipping or not, so. All right, I am going to redo my video. Don't let God's words be taken from me. I can't lie. This world has gone to hell fast All the gays and sodomites have come out of the closet It seems like since they have run out That us Christians Are being crucified We are being Stab, shot, and hung. Put in jail, but we did nothing wrong. See what happened. When you serve God, your Lord. But if it wasn't happening this very way, us Christians are not doing our, our job. Don't let God's word be taken from me. Do your job and lift God up. Don't let those sodomites go free. Please. Because oh, losing my Jesus is like living in hell to me. Do you not really see what's going on today? The killing of children, the killing of Christians all around. Israel's in trouble. God's promised land of his children Remember what he said That the narrow way is the only way To enter heaven Don't let God's word be taken from me do your 
job and lift God up. Don't let those sodomites go free. Cause losing my Jesus is like I'm, like I'm losing me. Oh, oh, oh. Losing my Jesus is like living in hell to me. Don't let God's word be taken from me. Do your job and lift God up. Don't let those sodomites go free. Cause losing my Jesus is like I'm, like I'm losing me. E Losing my Jesus is like I'm living in hell to me. It's like I'm living in hell to me. It sure is. Think about it. If you didn't have your Jesus and you couldn't worship your Jesus, you were not allowed to read that Bible. You weren't allowed to look at that Bible. Wouldn't it be like living in hell on earth? Oh, it sure would be to me, my brothers and sisters. If I could not open that if I could not open my Bible and look at it without fear, which I will not fear because I don't care. You can't take it from me. It's in here. And <laughs> you can take my book. Because I'll always have my Bible. I have many Bibles. Many Bibles. And I will continue to bring out Bibles upon Bibles upon Bibles. I will walk. I don't care if it's against the man's law or not, no whole long will continue to carry a Bible. Man's law or not, because my God's law says, mm -hmm. oh, Nicole, you almost said that. Oh, no, you didn't. Oh, I don't think he would have said that, Nicole. Oh. Mm. I rebuked that thought. Ooh, I don't think he would have said that. He would have said, forget men's law. Man's law is Jack Diddley. squat to God's law. But I don't think he would have said what I was thinking. He would have said, bullshit! Mm -mm, kiss my ass! Possibly. But he wouldn't have said what I was thinking. Mm -mm, I do not believe that bomb would have dropped out of his mouth. <laughs> and if that bomb would have dropped out of his mouth, do you know how pissed off God would have been to actually have used that bomb? Could you imagine that? For humans to actually get God that pissed for him to say that bomb? Oh, that just doesn't even... Oh, that's... Oh... That's an instant makes me want to puke. Oh, that makes me just fool. Yeah, yeah. Think about that. If God's mad enough to want to say, Daddy. right between the lines, If we humans have pissed gods off enough to say, read between the lines, you whiny ass, ungrateful little children. Ooh. Oh, dear Lord, forgive me of my sins.
Now that I have it, you forgive me of my mistakes. I repent of my sins. That's what the world needs to be saying. That's what the world needs to be saying now. Because God, oh. Oh, what if that was a thought of God? And he's that close to saying, you know what? Read between the lines, you whiny, ungrateful children. Could you imagine if we pissed God off that bad? Oh, Christians, you better repent. Oh, that just makes, oh. Repent, repent now, Christians. Repent now. And yes, this isn't, oh no, I don't care how bad, to no, know. you guys better repent, you better repent now. Because I don't care whether, no, nah, because, oh, you better repent, you better repent now, because think about it, if we have pissed God off to the point to where he wants to say, you know what, you whiny little brats of mine, read between the damn lines, I'm tired of you. Repent, children. Children of God, you better repent. He is coming. His time is coming soon. We have pissed him off to the point to where he, he, he is tired of it. All right. I got to upload this. You guys need to hear this. Love you. If you need to repent, you better repent. You guys better get into your prayer closets and pray now. Peace be with you. I love you guys. Repent.